Now, it's, it's been a long time since I myself have seen I've seen a case of this magnitude of the Oscar Pistorius case. But um, first impression, impressions around this case, if you could just give us a perspective. Well, basically, as I can see, uh, from my side, I'll always say a murder is a murder. So uh, I, I must say, that firstly, the police must do their work properly, yeah? They've got to do the investigation thoroughly. But uh, as far as I'm concerned, I think to a certain extent the state does have a prima facie case against him, definitely. Okay. And now there's lots of hype around this case um, and also around the police con contamination. I mean, it's already been mentioned and you wrote about this in your book. That's right. But what I want to know is in the long haul of this thing, if it goes to trial, how is it going to impact on this trial? What's going to happen? Is it, will it have an effect on it? Of course, definitely. You see, that's, and that's why the, the defense was concentrating so much on the crime scene itself. That's normally the game they play, and especially during a bail hearing, to see where they, where they can pick up certain loopholes during, during the, in the case itself. And that's why they, they also, during a bail hearing, tried to get all this information out as far as possible. Or also, furthermore, to just inform them, listen, that's the situation of your case, and, and to highlight that specific aspects that could maybe strengthen the, strengthen the defense case. But when we're in the High Court now and the trial proceeds, is, would it be possible for the defense to argue and completely discredit the entire case that the state has built? Yes. So they, they can't withdraw that. So they can't start the barrier all over again. It's on record. That's what he testified. Unfortunately, but I also felt he should have informed the state prosecutor, Advocate Harry now, and said what, what his situation was. And definitely also, I feel furthermore, his commander shouldn't have appointed him as a resident officer due to the fact he knows about what's the possibility also that he's going to be stand trial for, well, it seems to me he's going to stand trial for attempted murder. And that's what the defense is enjoying, because they break down your integrity and everything. Yep. Okay, and then just my final question. There is a lot of interest in this case internationally, but and there's also a lot of pressure on the South African judicial system. Um, it clouds and causes confusion, but what specifically should one be looking out for in this case? Well, specifically, they must, this crime scene, of course, that was priority number one. And the state must also, the also the Michigan office, they must try and get it as, as much as possible evidence against against the accused and do their homework on that percent. They must do their proper and thoroughly investigation. And don't just expect after two two weeks to complete your investigation. They they must carry until the last they must get some more evidence. Circumstantial evidence also can play a huge role. I always believe that in my case that I dealt with I normally circumstantial evidence also sometimes play the play plays also a huge role. And I think they must do it. And also the ballistics evidence is going to be very important here. So that is going to be very important. Okay, I've got a final question. Um, with the, when we look at Barry Rue, mm -hmm. who is Pistorius' defense. That's right. I mean, he's the man who defended um, Beers Rue. That's right. And Beers Rue walked away, also accused of murder. Yeah. But how can we compare these two, saying that it's the same AC who's defending both these men. Well, each and every case is different, and you know, the merits are completely different. I know Barry Roof personally for many years. He's an excellent advocate, senior counsel, acted as a judge also in the, already. But uh, I wrote, I'm, I'm not saying it's a comparison, but I probably can assure you he's an excellent defense counsel, that's for sure. Brilliant. Piet, ongelooflijk, thank you. I'm sorry. 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 I